breaking news hey yeah guys it was a boya kwa koko the government of national look of national confusion have collapsed uh place look I, 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 look i've got it here it has been reported that uh, by iol in the article that they've released, it says breaking news: ANC coalition with DA collapses amid leaked letters and political spats. Write an article released by um, o, an article released by Uka Mkhala uh, published 13 minutes ago, as of me reading this video. Now, there are so many things I've been trying to follow up the government of national confusion and trying to follow up a lot of things that are happening there and i can tell you this that there are a lot of things that are happening there uh, people are look uh, look uh, backstabbing one another people are hey man there, there, there's, there, there's quite a lot that is happening behind that that, that government of national unity of theirs right so <laughs> so I, I i'm gonna need to break it down but I wish we started with the previous video, with the previous uh previous things as well, where there's a le there's a leaked letter from the ANC, there's a th sorry there's a leaked letter from the DA, right? These leaked letters represent a situation where uh, you've got two parties that do not agree, represent a situation where. You saw the DA for what it is. It represents a situation where you kind of realize that the ANC got itself into an unfavorable position. You cannot go into a coalition with the DA hoping by look by chance that everything is gonna fall into look into the, in, 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 into place. That's definitely not going to happen. But the DA, I mean, sorry, the ANC. Um, I don't know what they were looking, what they were hoping to get, but yeah, they attempted that and it just backfired big time. I guess it, it is backfiring big time. So before we dive into the video, okay, guys, before we dive into the look at the, the latest news, um, I'm going to need you to just do me this few things, right? Tell me something. If I ask you to borrow me your money, you wouldn't, your house, look, your, your wife, you wouldn't, your kids, you wouldn't, your car, you wouldn't. So if I ask all of these things and you wouldn't do, why don't you do this? If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people. Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financial contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the super thanks party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? will bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay okay now let's go back uh, to the letter now uh the the heading of the letter says a coalition agreement between the anc and the da has lapsed highly placed source within the anc has confirmed that the deal is but uh, over following a series of disagreement and public spat between the two parties. As part of the, uh, government, the government of national unity arrangement, the ANC and the DA formed a voter based on, uh, on uh, around 60% of support with other uh, parties singing a signing a document of intent. Hey! <laughs> but... Mina, 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 guys, I, I, I'm not shocked. I mean, DA doesn't shock me. Like, honestly speaking, to those who might feel like they are shocked, I hope be like, what, what? Why are you shocked? Like, why are you shocked? For me, guys, I'm honestly, guys, I'm not shocked. 
However, just a week after electing President Rama, Pre, look, Ramaphosa as a president, the deal has reportedly backfired due to squabble over position at that and ministers. Uh, ministers, yes. This resulted in a flurry of leaked letters between the two political parties. Hey, the source then continued to say, "It's all, it's all but over. The D, the, the ANC is generally wasn't very thrilled with a DA coalition. This has been made worse because of how the DA has conducted itself, particularly around leaking information and letters to the media." Said the source. Another source who was privy to the high-level discussion said that the ANC negotiating team was not happy with the DA's posture. This second source says the following. The way the ANC is being spoken to and how the DA are coming across is a problem. The feeling is that we don't need the DA to form a government. So they must not think they can dictate the terms to us, says a source. The question is Benyap. 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 We hear that this, the, uh, but Beniap, Beniap, where were you going? Hey. President Ramaphosa, uh, look, President Ramaphosa's letter to the DA leader John Steinhuizen has accused the Democratic Alliance DA of uh, being uh, a look, a chameleon in the government of national unity negotiations and jeopardizing the formation of a unified government. This comes amid, amid reports that the Department of Trade and Industry portfolio is a source of tension in the ongoing negotiations between the DA and the African National Congress ANC. Helen Zilla, the DA federal chairperson, wrote, letter, wrote a letter to the ANC Secretary General Figel Mbalula informing him that her, part, her party deserved a a look, a score of mineral or ministerial position in the, in the government of national unity. Miraje umbuza mkule ngubuza benia pi. That's the that's the most important question I can ever ask you guys. Benia pi. Benia pla. Benia pla. Like honestly, guys. Eh, Okay, let's read this one. Regarding look, uh, regard your po uh, your approach in moving the 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 the, the, the goal spot as a uh, continuation of what was articulated in your federal chair letter of, 20, of June two thousand and twenty two, an issue such as sealed mandate of ministers through which the DA seems to the seems to want to set up a parallel government that will operate look, will operate outside the framework and the parameters of the constitution based method and protocol of running the government of the Republic of South Africa. Beniapi, Beniapi. Yabona manje, you're finding yourself in this um in this situation. The question is, Beniapi, you know, had you not chosen this path, you will not be embarrassed. Had you not chosen to form a government of national confusion with the DA, you will not have been embarrassed today. Beniapi. He, this would have been avoided, at least according to me. You have to tell me what you think. But honestly, according to me, this could have been avoided. We, the DA is busy bullying them, left, right, and center. The DA is busy showing them that, yeah, you know, we are the bosses here. And what are they going to say? Nothing. They aren't going to say anything to the DA. Because the DA is the DA, right? The DA is the boss. The DA believes that without them, there's no government of national unity. Well, according to me, yeah. <laughs> 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 